Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I'm back with another tutorial. Today I'm wearing a western outfit. I just love this top and uh, today I just bought it. I just wore it for the first time and it's very colorful and I'm sure I can go with a very, you know, a very mix mixed color of eye look. I can go for a very mixed color of eye look and it will be very funky and colorful. Anyway, let's head on to the video. Starting off with move, um, prepping my skin. I just took a shower, so I usually don't, I try to avoid doing makeup without tying my hair up. But there again. confused about what color to go for for the shadow this one's a pink there is a blue I think all right let's show on the palette I think the let's see let's see what the palette has got today uh, I'll be doing the base first Yes, I'll be doing the base first, so... There it goes. I think I'll just go ahead with the foundation first. I'll go with a light base today. Not a very heavy one. I'll do the concealer part later after my eyeshadow. Taking the L'Oreal Infallible Again the usual drill Blend and blend and blend My skin is quite oily so I go for matte foundations I'm a big fan of matte foundations Alright, then 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 looks like I'm done. Alright, now I'll head on to the eyeshadow the palette that I'll use. My favorite friends. Okay, let's hope that we find something that goes with this outfit. Okay, there are browns. There's a pink that I did um, a look with before and there is a brown it, this one is a purplish color the color is just similar to this but unfortunately there is no dark brown so I think we can go with a combination of a pink yes a combination of a pink and <coughs> maybe 
maybe this one the list shade the shade the list and Frank Jr. Jr. okay or we might as well go with the shade Java there are a lot of you know pink shades there's also a pink shade called fancy guest anyway let me start doing my um let me start doing my eyeshadow eventually I'll just say the names that I'm going for I'll show you what I'm going for okay putting on some concealer Okay, I'll just, you know, take the foundation all over my lid. Now let's go for the eyeshadow. I'm quite excited because there's a lot of color to, colors to use. Okay. Still as a transition transition color. Okay, let's go for the transition color later. First, a base. We need a good base. I think for the base, I'll go with the um, Dr. Drake Remore. This shade right here. Okay. Taking a fluffy brush. Wow, this actually looks like the perfect color, which goes with the outfit. It's a very, you know, subtle purple bluey tone. <clears throat> Moving on to my other eye. I think I'll put on some more purple. I'm liking this color. All right, here's the shade. I just wanna make it more intense. Okay, so I guess I'm done. Now I'll, I have to choose a pink, a good pink color. Okay, I think I'll go for Dr. Uh, Frank Jr. Jr. So for this, I'll be using a flat brush, the flat one, and I'll be going with the shade, this pink, Frank Jr. Jr. Or should I go with Java? I don't know, I'm so confused right now. Anyway, okay, let's go with Frank Jr. Jr. Let's give it a go. Take some in, using the flat brush. Oh my God, I'm so in love with the pigmentation of these shadows. I, the pink, the purple, uh, the pink shade actually got on well with the purple one. On some more. Oops. 
there are a little fallouts. I'll wipe them off. I think when we see fallouts, it's better to just you know, push the shadow onto your lid rather than rubbing it. There it is. Moving on to my other eye. And again, some more pink. See, there are fall-offs. Even, even after being so careful, there are fall-offs. <clears throat> Hence, I prefer, you know, doing the concealer part later. I think I'll just keep it like this, as simple as this. And yeah, this actually looks good. It, it paired up nice with the purple that I used before. Now I'll give a little brush up with the purple. Dr. Do shade Dr. Drake Remore. And yes, I'll go with the liner. See, over time. The fear is going off. I'll go with the liner. So yeah. Today I'll finish my eyes first. Okay. Oh, I already did my base. So yes, there's nothing to worry about. Oh my god, I'm so happy with the eye look. This will look perfect with the liner. Okay, moving on to the liner. So there's this saying which says, practice makes a man perfect. This is the proof. Practice made me perfect. So I went for a very thin liner. There it is. Done with the eyes. And yes, yeah, time for some mascara. Make sure before you begin with the concealer, you wipe off all the fall-offs that you have got or brush them off. So I'll wipe off the, um, the fall-offs. Alright, I'll head on to the concealer.
to blend. Give it as more blends as possible. The more you blend, the more smooth your base will look. Okay, time to knead up the brow bone and the highlight. using a golden shade okay I'll be using the shade orthodontist from this palette itself to highlight the brow bone yes. wow it has a very nice texture if you can quite shimmery all right moving on now I'll move on to my blush moving on to the blush today is a no bronzer day I'll just straight away do the blush Wow, I'm just in love with the eye look today. All right, time for some highlights. Since I already did my brow bone, I'll just go with my usual. Let's just highlight the cheekbones. So done with the highlights and yeah now, today I will go with a very bright lip color it's going to be a very bright pink so this is, is this the one okay yeah this is a lipstick from eye magic in the shade 7 I'll go with this pink Let's dare to do this. Or I don't know, I'm so confused. Maybe, okay, there's another shade of Eye Magic which is cl quite close to Rebel Rose. I think I can go with this one. No, let's go for something bright today. Or maybe I'll do a mixture. Let's see. Okay, the pink looks quite good. It will look more matte once it dries up. So yeah, I think I'll stick to this pink. So I'm done, I'm done with the tutorial. I'm done with my makeup. 
So guys, this is the final look. I'm so in love with the eyeshadow. And just look at the combination of the purple. And it actually, the pink complemented the purple. It blended so well. It looks very nice. It looks very nice with the outfit that I'm wearing. Although it's not totally blue, but it still looks nice. So here it is. This was the makeup look. If you have any queries and questions, the comment section is open. You can ask out anything and you can um, ask out any questions, come up with suggestions that what sort of looks I can do and I will appreciate your feedbacks. Anyway, I'll end it here today. I hope you all subscribe to my channel and please give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching.